So I'd have to say I've been coming here to the USA since 1989. I've never had such a good place to work with training dogs. And the more of these areas that we can find to train dogs in, the better behaved the dogs become. You see, the dog will only become good and under good control if we can go out and practice in these sort of areas. Um, this is absolutely fantastic and we're losing more and more places where we can take dogs because we, we're losing places to go and train them like this. This is real life training. This is completely different from going to a dog training class in a facility where those dogs have no freedom anyway. Since you're on the chair, just call your dog. And we'll see what happens. Okay. That, I'm guessing here the dogs, when they're puppies, are probably allowed an awful lot of freedom and then the handlers get into the pattern when they bring them out, not touching them enough, not engaging with the dogs enough. You know, these, these look like more dogs that are taken hiking instead of dogs that are actually trained to come when called. <laughs> Genetically, um, our dogs are a far cry from wolves and we've always had dogs in our lives based on the relationship that exists between an owner and a dog. Come on in. Rock out, back, don't twist. Good dog. There's a good dog. There's a clever dog. I promise you on Sunday, if you have a relationship with your dog, if it loves you, it will come when, you, when it's called. This is now working on, on you, not on the dog. We know that the dogs will all stop. So are you able to change your behavior? At what point will you accept that the dog's done it, reward it and finish there? How many are gonna push the dog beyond that because they get a bit competitive? Okay. Good. Okay, let go. How much are you actually giving the dog to do that it enjoys on a daily basis? So if you say, I take my dog out for a walk once a day, and you want to improve your relationship, I'm gonna say stop taking it out for a walk once a day. If you go out for one hour, take it out four times a day for 15 minutes. Now it's got four things to look forward to with you. It changes its behavior. And I'd have to say, I've been coming to the USA since 1989. I've never found a better facility to train dogs. <laughs> this has been amazing. So, Todd, these are for you. Thank you so much. It's Todd who's allowed us to use this place. Fantastic place to train dogs. It, honestly, dog training doesn't get better than this. This is the perfect place to do this sort of thing because this is more real life than anywhere I've ever trained in the USA. Right.